And I'll do Brian B R Y N. And I'll do five, I guess, medium and five honey barbecue. You said you want to bone it, Yeah. And then an order of uh, french fries. A regular or a basket? Uh, which one's bigger? Basket. The basket's good. And then a large Coca Cola. We have Pepsi products. So Pepsi, Duck Pepper. Um, Pepsi's fine. Any ranch or bougie? Uh, yeah, ranch. It's gonna be five honey barbecue, five medium with ranch, a basket of fries, and a large Pepsi. It's gonna be 2021. All right. Here you go. All right. That's thank okay. you so much. What's up, guys? It's Brian from Jim Coy, and. <laughs> Won't you say Brie? Is it Brie from Jim Coy too? It's Brie from Jim Coy. <laughs> <laughs> kind of rings. Anyway, guys, uh, we're here coming to meet uh, uh, a trainer I've been using so to kind of get a uh, kind of last measurement, kind of like an emergency one. Um, just mentally, my thoughts have been kind of just getting the best of me and wanting to go deeper down and drop my calories and carbs and fats and everything just even more. Than before guys and um it kind of effect, affected me a little bit and i was just trying to do drastic stuff that to really get down to the shredded bone you know this is me being real with you uh that you know i just felt like i don't think i should be going outside the boundaries of what we're restricted at already because it's going even lower than what i was restricted to and it's just you know something can consume your mind so greatly guys and you can start doing drastic stuff even as far as fitness like be smart like don't try to just go too much and, and, and think that, oh, I can even drop even lower and, and possibly, like, uh, you can do some damage to your body is what I guess I'm trying to say. Because if you're not having some, like, somebody helping you along the way, as I'm telling you guys, like, that knows what they're doing and knows how to handle and seen this before, um, it can be detrimental to you. So just be sure that you do have advice on people when you are working with somebody if you're prepping for a show or just losing great amounts of weight or weight in general you know, be healthy about it, you know, so for me, it was my third day of really cutting everything so low that it wasn't really healthy, so that's why I was like, hey, I think we need to reevaluate my mind and just my numbers real quick, so um, let me uh, let me just meet up with you, so anyway, guys, that's why I'm here, and I'm um, just being real with you guys, again, show everything to you raw and being truthful, so anyway, we're gonna go meet him, get our body, body measurements weighed out again, um, and uh, yeah, guys, that's why Bree's come along with me, so. I'm gonna find out my body fat percentage today because I'm super curious. Yeah, so. And I just got Invisalign today. Oh so. yeah, she got Invisalign. She <laughs> has like these like things on her teeth so now, so. kind of talking with a lisp. She has a lisp going right now, so. <laughs> so. <laughs> anyway guys, we're gonna go check in with him and we'll see you guys there. I don't know, dude. I just, I just want to make know that I can possibly get to where I want to be you think them. if anybody saw those before and after pictures that they would um, even care? Probably not. Okay. <laughs> I know. So you, you're 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 talking about ego. I know. You're talking about ego. And I told myself I didn't want to, and I'm trying not to. You need to not look at the competition anymore, and you got to start just thinking scientifically. There's only so much your body can do, and your body is. I mean, we're we're kind of maxing it out, man. Like we're we're maxing it out and we're yeah. doing it as fast as we can, um, and I you can want for more things to happen, but now you're going against science, and now you're just uh, not being very logical about the changes and things that you'll make because it's kind of impossible to speed up fat loss on top of what we're already doing, and in that one particular area. So as we're finishing up our meal prep right now, Brie and I are indulging a little bit on the finer things <laughs> of chocolate. But only by smells. So this is what it's come down to, you guys. Smelling, what is that, babe? Chocolate mousse. Smelling chocolate mousse. So I ordered meals from Adrian um, with Complete Eats last week, and he, <laughs> when he dropped them off, he said, I put a little surprise in your bag for you just for you to smell, but then spray it with Windex and throw it away. Yeah. So it's a little 
little cup of chocolate mousse with two little blueberries on it. And it actually smells delicious. Like, oh, the smell actually makes me feel better. It's like smelling heaven. Like, <laughs> I'm high right now. <laughs> God, that smells so good. Like, now we have to spray it with Windex. we gotta spray it with Windex before we like really we eat it. eat it. Okay, spray one, it, babe. One last smell. One smell. Okay. Ah, yes. Spray that shit. Woo! <laughs> We were crazy. Now we're gonna throw it away. I know we're crazy. Like, you don't wanna be in this house right now, guys. Like, this is craziness going on here. It's crazy. I feel pretty crazy. I feel pretty crazy. All right, Jordan. All right, I sure appreciate you. Of course, man. There's a, that's a Pepsi right there. And these are 10 wings. That is with it's honey barbecue and mild and a large basket of fries, man. Happy Friday, saying, man. you know. I see you out here all the time. Helps you out with his clothes a while back, and man, I just always like doing something yeah, nice, I, man. Yeah, I like them shirts. Good, you man. Know, a little jacket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm glad you appreciate it, man. I had one the uh, other day. Yeah? Yeah. Good, man. Well, I don't know if it's going to get any much colder out here. It's warm now, but at least you have something to wear. So, I mean, okay, I appreciate enjoy it. your food. I hope you like it. There's ranch in there, too, and napkins and all stuff you yeah, need, I brother. Yeah, All right? Because I was home. Bro. I bet you were, man. All right, man. You hey. have a good, yourself a good day. God bless you, dude. Hey, you take care. Man. You, too. All right, guys. So, as you saw, that food was not for me, but... uh you know, I see Jordan there on the side of the street every single day for the past year I've been on this side of town here in Houston. And, you know, as you guys saw last time, um, you know, I, I gave him some clothes, you know, because it was starting to get cold. It was fall time and everything. And so, you know, I had extra clothes. I could have went and donated somewhere else. But, you know, I see him wearing the same stuff all the time. And I wanted to kind of give him that. So, and today, I don't know, I just, I couldn't resist something just told me today that I just, you know, I needed to do something nice for this gentleman. You know, just food. I mean, guys, we see guys, we see people all the time on the side of the street, you know, asking for food and money, and you just, you never know their story. You know, I, I still don't even know Jordan's story of what happened to him, but you know, it doesn't matter because, you know, it's just doing something nice for somebody. You know, despite I don't have millions of dollars, you know, and Jim Coy's not launched yet, and you know, I'm spending money like that, like, I don't care. You know, it's something just to help somebody out and make their day a little bit brighter. It's so gratifying to do something for somebody like that who needs help. And this is somebody who cares, you know, and I just, I, I, I enjoy doing it, guys. And, you know, I continue to bless people as much as I can. You know, that's, that's, what, that's what I'm about. That's what Jim Quish is trying to help people do with in other ways with fitness. And that's what it's all about, guys. And so, I don't know. As much as I would love to join him on Buffalo Wild Wings and eating fried pickles and french fries and Coca-Cola and all that stuff. 16 days away, guys. 16 days away. You know, and I just feel great right now. And today's Friday. It's a beautiful day outside here in Houston. Sun, blue skies, sunny. And it just, I felt great. And I just wanted to do that for him. So, like I said, I couldn't resist. And I had to help him. So... Anyway guys, I hope that's I hope you enjoyed this footage and that's gonna conclude this video. Oh actually no, I still have weigh in tomorrow, so I'll get that for you guys. But I hope you enjoyed that. And just I hope I encourage you, even if it's not fitness guys, just go out and help somebody do something. Try to brighten somebody's day just a little bit better. Despite if it doesn't have to be a big thing, like I just bought food for twenty bucks for him, you know? Just help somebody. Because this world needs it. Alright guys, check with you guys back in after a while. Jim Coy. It is uh, April, I think April 8th, 2017. So, new little in guys, 183.8, uh, which is great. Keep dropping the scale. Um, so, I think last week I was like 188, I believe, something like that. 187, 188, around there, roughly. I don't want to go back again like I did a few years ago. <laughs> I to look. But anyway, it's low. So, uh, yeah, guys, just keep dropping it. I mean, the show's in two weeks. So hopefully I can step on stage with another like five to 10 pounds lighter. Uh, like I can step in the 170 range. So um, feel good guys. Uh, 
you know, it's one of those things where you just, you know, towards the end of the goal, I mean, towards the end of the finish line, almost hitting your goal, and literally two weeks away, and just gotta plug it in the, in the hyperdrive mode, you know? Just keep going harder and harder to get as super shredded as possible. You know, I know with the NPC, there's guys who are on like, you know, certain, you know, like steroids or growth hormones and like that. I mean, being natural right now, it's like trying to get as ripped and shredded as possible. You know, so, you know, we'll get it, guys. I mean, it's, it's not going to be easy to really drop down. I mean, again, you saw where I started, guys, at 234 pounds, you know, and, and, and 20, 23% 20, body fat, something like that. I got measured the other day about three days ago or two days ago. I was at 10%. So, big, big increase and decrease in that. Um, so, just excited, guys, and um, kind of update you guys. Let's just see, like, kind of like, where am I? Physique is at right now. So that's kind of where the abs shows. The chest, I have lats popping out right there. So, I'm excited, guys. So, but anyway, guys, I mean, that's look at the down to Of course, it's going to look a lot different when we're like tanned and everything and drop a little bit more lower in body fat percentage, too, as well. But, uh, it's coming guys, we're excited, so. Anyway, that's gonna conclude. Uh, well, not gonna conclude it yet. I'm gonna go do some other stuff today too, I might take you along with me, but. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed the footage of, of again, meeting with Jordan. Um, you know, he's a gentleman I gave my clothes to a while back too, for the, for uh, just to give him my clothes because I knew it was getting cold. And um, again guys, just be real with yourself, help people, make people stay brighter. Like I talked about the other day, and just it feels good. That's the ultimate reward you get from satisfaction. You just feel good, you know. And no matter what inspires you to do things you do, just do it and just help somebody's day get brighter. That's all. All right, guys. Check you guys back in a bit. All right, guys. So that is going to conclude this video. Actually, I was gonna go get rid of my car or sell it, but I'll just wait till Monday. It's a lot going on, so we're about to make some turkey burgers right now. Those. Zinio turkey burgers. Maybe. Maybe. Bree's not liking the macros, apparently. I, I don't know. I think they look pretty processed. Really? Mm-hmm. What are the macros? Ten fats, zero carbs. Ten fat? Fun, but it's like 410 milligrams of sodium. Wow. This may be a no. All right. Well, there it is, guys. Anyway... I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, I hope you enjoyed everything that we did. And two weeks left, you guys. This coming week and then show week. So, let's get ready. 183, new low. So, all right guys, have a great week. And we'll see you on the next one.